Hey guys, it's Strawberry Bun again. Um, today I just wanted to showcase another one of my RTA matches in G3 where I felt it was a pretty insane comeback. So without getting much into details, I'm just gonna go into the match. So um, the opponent went with a really heavy CC route while I tried to go on the counter active and start picking a lot of cleansers. So here I went with the standard first pick Molong. Um, opponent went with the Sierra Gianna, Gianna so straight away I knew it was going to be a heavy CC heavy comp so I tried to counter it with Juno and the two account girls um, because both of them have planted so I'm going to set it to two times speed so right off the bat I knew the opponent was going to um, get the Tiana off um, the reason why I banned the Sierra is because with the Sierra it's going to be too much burst damage and I was afraid that I wouldn't be able to tank it so um, already you can see as the battle starts, like all our team, the entirety of our team is getting heavily CC'd. So I was banking on the account girls to get like some procs here, maybe to get up a cleanse. But it didn't, but because they were all bombed up, like both of them got the additional turn. You can see both of them got an additional turn here, but they got bombed anyway, so they couldn't move in. And sure enough, you know, it's, it's going to be the end of um, these two account girls now. So right now he's going for the Nikki. Um, he uses the combo there. Um, really good play by him. So that way he can kill off the Annabelle. Um, so my Nikki got a lucky heal off here. Um, so it, it sort of like brought a bit more sustain. But even then he was getting some violent procs with his Virat there, putting us on the CC. Um, so it was basically I kind of lost hope here. Um, I felt it was um, a good game. And because I knew Nikki was going to fall, um, we got a lucky stun here on the... Oh, we didn't even get a stun here. So, um, last thing Nikki does before she um, she dies is she got her third skill off, which did a, quite a bit of damage because I think my opponent um, runs his units really fast. So, um, right here, Nikki falls and it was 2 on 4 from here onwards. So, I think the turning point here was here, right this moment itself when the bombs missed my panda and got a bomb on the Juno. So this triple stun was another turning point in the game. And here I instantly knew the comeback was possible once I got the triple stun there. So you can see um, it's a Juno here. And I knew like the only threat was the Varad. So I used the Reckless Assault on the Varad and Juno mops up. So Juno got a double stun there and it's it's all a Juno, it's all Juno and like from here onwards. I think the main thing to take away with this is like the post buff Juno is really really good because she brought a lot of sustain in the beginning there when all the bombs um, landed on her. Yeah, yeah, the bombs, it, it might have been pretty good um, previously as well but you can see like when the Malaka put the bomb on her, um, she managed to cleanse it as well. So you can't really bomb a Juno um, with the new buff. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, I just want to show you guys the runes of the units. Um, so you can see here, um, let me see, the units that were picked were my Molong. So my Molong's on a Violet Wheel Rune, a Violet Wheel Build. Um, these, are the, these are his stats. Um, another one would be Juno. So I rune my Juno to be slightly faster than my Molong, just so that I can um, get those stuns off, get those strips off before I get the stuns off. So she's on the Despair Revenge build. Those were the runes that make up her stats. Um, another one that was... Um, highlighted was Annabel, although she didn't even do much. She's just on a standard violent wheel build. Um, these are the stats. And the last one was Nikki. Um, she's on violent wheel as well. And these um like these are the runes that make up her stats. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed that um that comeback match. Um, I'll see if I can do more RTA showcases on like random matches that I play throughout the week that I really enjoy, and where I felt that you know, um like we we got a. Like we got really lucky, some matches that we get really lucky where RNG is on our side and um, matches that highlight good comebacks. Okay, I so thanks you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!